Hello everybody, it's Luna Lisa here. I know I've been gone for quite a while. I haven't made a video. Um, I haven't really got anything. <laughs> so I have the few items that I have, that'll, that'll be my video. And uh, it's going to be a mashup between Dollar Tree, Garage Sale, and Marshalls. I'm really excited about that one, and then one of my little projects that I finally fin I finished, I finished it, it's been a uh, while I finished it, but I just haven't made a video, so, okay, so let me start, I'm going to do garage sale finds today, right now, I've already had these for a while, but you know, like I said, we've been going through a family, family crisis, and um, and yeah, it's been a bummer. Very, we're very, very, very sad. And uh, I haven't been able to make a video. I look, I know I look terrible, but it's been really, really, really sad. It's my father-in-law. It's very sick very sick and been just here for my husband just trying to lift his spirits and it doesn't look good it doesn't look good and uh, so yeah we've been dealing with that and uh, haven't had any time to make videos or anything and I had these few things accumulated, so I decided, okay, might as well just make just a quick video. I don't care, my hair is a mess. I just took shower, it just it's air dried, you know. I took shower. It's it is what it is, okay. I don't care right now, but um, okay. I'm gonna start up with garage sale finds. Jacob got a whole bunch of stuff, bunch of stuff, but. If we go through everything, it is going to be a pretty long video, but he was lucky boy. He got a lot of stuff, a lot. It was crazy how much stuff he got and very cheaply, like dollar for everything, and he just brought the whole kit and caboodle. You know, it, it was good for him, you know. And just this few items I got for myself, but the rest was his, but, I, you know. I can't make a video about that because it's just, it's just too much. It's just too much, right? Right. <laughs> okay. Well, the first item is I found a Mandy doll. I already have one, but I found her and she has like little pink, little rosebuds. The one that I have has yellow, right? right. Has yellow little rosebuds. So I got the Mandy doll. She had like little out, a little outfit, but I had to wash it, so I gotta wash her hair, comb it. I collect dolls, you know. <laughs> it's crazy, but yeah, I collect dolls. You see my shelving over here in the back? It's new. My hubby did it for me, and I am going to make like home, like a, like a. It. Um, maybe like a little like 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 a house for my 18 inch doll and uh, yeah she's gonna be up there I'm gonna make like sofa and you know I have like a little like a little wardrobe little wooden little like a little closet I'm gonna make sofas I'm gonna make up their beds a, a lot of it I'm gonna maybe do it myself like DIYs and um, law and order <laughs> I'm watching law and order <laughs> okay uh, I got distracted I'm oh, sorry <laughs> okay so this is this this is a man we I named her Hazel so I don't know what her, I think because the other one looks exactly like this except for the the little rosebuds are different color so I don't know if she's like a different girl or she's just Mandy if she's like another version of Mandy but yeah I got her 
And then I got this other one. I know my husband's gonna be like, oh, she's freaking creepy because he don't like dolls. <laughs> but I thought she was cute. Look. I named her Aiko. I always, I always write their names on their butts. She has her little outfit too, a little purple, little pretty, little purple, little little long little shirt with little pants to cover up her, like little pajama pants and then a little purple top. It looks like a dress, but I thought she was so cute. I thought she was cute. She'll be, she's going to be for my collection. Maybe she'll be sitting on my bed or something. I said my husband will like that. I don't know. Because he don't like dolls. He, he always thinks they're creepy. But I thought she was like really adorable and really cute. And she's like porcelain. She's like made out of porcelain. I used to have a, a doll long ago. Like he, when my kids were little, he threw her on the floor and broke her. He was like, he was like trying to throw it like on the chair that I had in in the room and it bounced and she fell and she cracked her and her face got cracked and I was just like so upset I was like why did you throw her you know she's breakable it's like why well, didn't know you would break mm. men <laughs> and then I found this one in the same area that I found her I, I, I got her for how much she was like three dollars I think I got her for three she cost me three dollars. Um, Aiko was what? This one? Dollar, I think, or two dollars. I think I paid two dollars for her. And she's from, uh, I read it here somewhere. Ashton Drake Galleries. She's, so she's an Ashton Drake Gallery doll. I think those are kind of expensive. So I said, yes, she's coming home with me. And the Mandy, she's a Fisher Price doll. She's three dollars. I got her for three. And then I got this girl's Our Generation. She also had her little shirt, a little vest, a little blue jean skirt with like cute little boots. And the boots were from American Girl doll. So I was like, wow, I got the little American Girl boots. But she's a She's an Our Generation doll. Um, where does Our Generation get sold? Target? I believe it's Target. But I thought she was so pretty. I don't know who she is. But I named her Peyton. <laughs> I named her Peyton because I don't know who she is or what. Because I know they always come out with their names and stuff. But I usually rename them because I don't know. So a lot of my dolls that I have, I have gotten from the garage sale. So I rename them. I give them their, my own name, what I like. This item is in the same area, in the same place where I got the dolls. I got this pillow. It's a little snowman. So cute. It's made out of like felt. I thought it was really cute. This one, like 50 cents. She's like, 50 cents for all the Christmas pillows. I'm like, okay. Yes, I already, I already washed them. It's washed, dry. Like I said, I haven't been doing any videos. They, they were there drying, drying, drying. And then I got this one. It's a Santa. He's so cute. I thought he was really cute. I might change the nose. I don't like this nose. It's too red. <laughs> it don't look very well. I don't think I don't like that. And then some of that green, this green felt is like showing here. I don't know if it got if like some little kid took scissors to it and chopped it, chopped it there because it's it's showing through. But I thought it was very adorable for Christmas. 50 cents. Again, 50 cents. I was like, yes. Yes, please. Come with me. So those are my dollar... My dollar tree. Jeez. I mean, my garage sale finds. 
So next is going to be the Dollar Tree. My Dollar Tree. These items, almost everything my daughter went and she got them for me. She was like, Mom, do you want this? Do you want this? Do you want this? This, this, this? Yes, 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 yes. So these are very different from, I don't know if this was from out of town or from here locally. I'm not really sure. But she got me this. Isn't that cute? I know they're not they're they're not the dollar. They're not a dollar. These were in the three to five aisle. So this I believe it was three dollars. I took off the tag already. Like I said, I've already had these things for over a week. Oh way over that. I don't even know when was my last video I po posted, but yeah, I got this one, and then she got into another, these are several days of hauls, they're not all the same haul, not all, not all the haul the same day, she went several days, she got me this cutter, I already opened it, I got this cutter, it's like fabric cutter, it's from Dollar Tree, from the Crafter Square, and I want to, and I don't know how, if it works, good I don't know I haven't tried it yet but but I liked it I was like yeah get me that because I want to try it hopefully it'll, it's easy like to cut fabric I want that's what I wanted for so I got this too and then she found me the little red truck isn't this so cute adorable I'm going to make my little truck I hopefully it'll come out I don't know how it will work but I bought two I told her bring me two so I'm thinking of making the truck like making it I don't know I don't know how I'm gonna do this part like fill in here you know I gotta look for videos maybe someone has done it I don't know I'll look I'll look it up if not, I'll just hang it on the wall or put it in my, in my, um, cubby, my cupboard. Then she found me. Remember the signs that I told you that I wanted? She found it for me. She found me the ho-ho-ho. Yeah, this is the, the one I, re I originally wanted. But she only got me the other one with the, the leaf. I think it was the reindeer that says the leaf. So she got, found me this one. <laughs> And then she found me this one. It says, let it snow. I just thought they were so cute. So I said, yes. Yes, give me that one. I wanted that one. So cute. I don't know where I'm going to put them, but I'm going to have to uh, figure it out. But yeah, I got them. I got them. Next. The, her friend finally brought our... Our little gnomies, the ones I told you, they were for four dollars, the fourteen inches. Uh, yes, yeah, the four, they're fourteen inches. Look at them, this is so cute. They have little feet, little arms, the little, the little beard. I gotta comb it out. It's kind of like real rough. It's looking rough, bud. Your beard's looking a little rough. You're looking a little scruffy there. Kind of brush it out. I got this red, and there those two type of reds. I got this red, and I got this one. Oh, so cute! You can tell that they have a slight, slight, slight difference in like he feels more chubby than this one. He feels a little bit more slim. He's more slender looking. He's got a scruffy beard too. I gotta comb it out. But I like the top of his hat. So cute. So cute. They're both very cute. But can you see how one looks chubbier than the other? This one's chubby and this one's more slender. So I got the two red. And I got the gray. Look at him, aren't they so cute? They got a precious little beard out, buddy. You're a little scruffy there. 
Oh my god, I'm just like in love with these gnomes. They was my sign that I got, and known for the holidays. And then I have the little, the little towel with the gnome on it. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna start making my gnomes now, my Christmas gnomes. I gotta start, I haven't even started. And I gotta do them. And I wanna show my, uh, the one that I made for Thanksgiving. I finally finished them. And here we go. Look at this little guy. Oh my god. I'm just like in love with him. He is super, super cute. I got, I bought the pattern. It's from, oh my gosh, Dwayne King. I, th I believe his name is Dwayne King. He makes these gnomes. He sells at his Etsy shop the pattern to make these gnomes. So I ordered it. They're like $9, I think. And you just go to his Etsy shop and he sells the patterns to make these little guys. He gives you the pattern to make the body. Out of one sheet of, of felt, the, the body, the face, and the arms come out through that one 12 by 12 felt sheet. And then you need two felt sheets for the hat. It's an inner hat, the outer hat, and then all the little leaves will come out in the two pieces of felt. Oh my god. And then you just embellish them how you want. So there's the little ribbon that I bought at Dollar Tree. That's, that's one of the ribbons. And then I just glued on a little, a little maple leaf and then some raffia. You can embellish them however you want. Like All he gives you is the, the, the idea for the whole body and you embellish him how you want. If you want to add him the the arms you don't you don't and you just buy like little wooden beads for the little hands and then the little wood beads for the little nose and you embellish them how you want to and it was super easy to make really super easy I'm making another one for her, but his, his body's like brown and I, I don't know what I'm gonna what color I'm gonna use for the top maybe a green I have a green there I don't know I might use that, but oh my goodness, he came out super, super cute. Or I believe I was gonna use another fabric for the hat because you don't have to always. You don't. He says you don't have to always make the hat like this. You can use other hats. You can use fabric, or you can just cut them out and cut out cone shapes and then make the hat. You don't have to always use this pattern. You can just basically do what you want and it's it came out super cute i'm so happy my daughter's was like i made hers out of a more darker into the brown shade of the of the felt and then the her hat is like a like a like a tan color it came out super cute i decorated him hers the same way with just different color raffia probably in different color um leaf and different ribbon but yeah he came out so cute I love him I absolutely love him I I had so much fun making them so much fun making them and they're tiny I mean they're they're tiny he, he, he's a tiny little guy but he's so cute you see compared to the Dollar Tree one Compared to the Dollar Tree, he's, he's a tiny little guy, but I don't care. They're just super cute. Super cute. I'm just in love with them. I'm in love with all of them. So, there you go, honey. You stay there. Now, for the piece of resistance. <laughs> Remember I told you that in the last, I don't know what, how many videos back that I said that I saw that Ray done make gnomes and i told my daughter you have to find it well her friend was in san antonio and found the gnomes and 
And then my daughter told her, yes, my mom wants one. Bring one, bring one. She didn't buy one. And I told her, you're going to regret not getting it. She probably will regret it because, oh, my God. They're adorable. He was $12.99. I don't care. I don't care. But... Look at him. his little big old feet. He's carrying a little pumpkin. His white fur, his shrubby nose, and says, Happy Harvest. Oh my God. And when she she showed me the picture, and she's like, Mom, is the Happy Harvest one is the one you wanted? And I was like, Yes. And she showed me the picture, and she says, Is it this one? I'm like, Yes. And there was like other ones in the background, like other different patterns. And I was like, Oh. My God, I want them all, but I I just picked this one. I picked this one because it goes more with my colors. Because my colors in my living room are basically like that. I have a lot of orange, a lot of orange, and the other ones were like gray, and like I hardly have anything gray in there. The only thing I have gray in there is a pumpkin that I made out of a blanket. So look. God, and he's humongous. I don't remember the. I took a tag. Oh crap! I don't remember the how high he is. I don't even have my measuring tape. But yeah, look, you can either have his his little hat like that, but I like it bent like this. You bend it. I think it looks more cute like that. Isn't that adorable, people? Oh my goodness, he's huge. I have him on my, on my center table there in the living room because he couldn't fit anywhere else. But I think I, I'm happy with just one. You know, I'm happy. I wanted all of them, but I'm like thinking, where would I put them if I had gotten the other ones? Because I, I didn't even have space for him because he's, he's so huge. He's just huge. Oh my God, he's he's adorable 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 okay well that's it it's been a while like I said I'm sorry I haven't had any time to do these to do a video and I just decided right now since I had all this stuff I was like oh my god I have so much stuff to show but like I said family crisis right now and and, uh, uh, well, that's what's going on in our life right now. But, yeah, I'm really, really happy. I got my nomies finally in my hands. Got them in my grasp. Got my, and then I'm going to make my, my Christmas, my Christmas nomies. So I'm going to have a whole bunch of nomies for Christmas. I'm going to have three for Thanksgiving. That's that's all I that's all I have. So I, I didn't have any other colors, Thanksgiving colors with the felt. But next year I'll probably make them during the during the rest of the year and I'll have more for Thanksgiving. Cuz I need more in my life. So I might make more. So now I'm going to start doing my Christmas ones. And then maybe I'll show, I'll make a video on those too. So, I hope everybody has a happy Thanksgiving. I just hope they don't come up with some crap here that we're not allowed to be with our family. Because that would be terrible. You know? And, um, well, like I said, I hope everybody has a happy Thanksgiving. Happy, have a happy and safe Thanksgiving. Wear your masks, please. Wear your masks. I'm telling you by experience. This is what happened to my father-in-law. I'm telling you, wear your masks. It's very important. It's very important. Very important. Wear your masks at all times, please. 
Okay, people. Give me a thumbs up. Give me a like, thumbs up, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye now.